And UTEP is continuing its preparations for its home opener Saturday versus Incarnate Word after dropping their season opener at Jacksonville State last week. And the Word made the FCS semifinals last year. They have reloaded under new head coach Clint Killow. The Cardinals have nine players that played big minutes at FBS and Power 5 schools last year, including running back Trey Siggers and defensive back Stephen Parker. Now, the most important of them all, though, might be quarterback Zach Calzada. He did not play at all last year when he was at Auburn, but in 2021 at Texas A&M, he threw for over 2,000 yards and 17 touchdowns and engineered an Aggies upset of Alabama in which he threw three touchdowns. I mean, A&M recruited him because he's a good player, right? I mean, the talent's there for him, um, and I'm sure he's excited. They got a great offense. You know, he's coming in. He's, they got, got a neat offense for him to be a part of, and he's looking forward to being a part of that. And and uh, and that's kind of the mo for a lot of their players right now. A lot of their, you know, their secondaries guys that have started in Power Five places. Don't sleep on the word. Calzada beat Alabama. He will not be afraid of the Sun Bowl. Neither will the entire Cardinals roster. UTEP will have to play well Saturday. Kickoff is at 7 p.m.